What's going on, folks? Clutch here, back on County Line. How are you guys doing today? Hope you're having a fantastic day. We are, well, we're in the snow. Look at that. I've been busy plowing away. Um, just trying to keep the farm as kind of neat and tidy as possible so we can get around it. Now, what is going on today? Well, we've obviously got a lot of snow to clear. So, first of all, we've got some contracts in town. we got some plowing to go do. We got called from the local case dealership and the fuel station for some reason. They, uh, they need to get some plowing done over there. So we're going to head up that way. We'll take our, uh, I think one of our trucks. I think we're going to do the highway plow here. The highway plow has been getting a lot of use out here. But we're not going to need it where we're going. And uh, we're going to just go see if we can clean up the town a little bit. Now back on the farm. Well, our orchard's still, everything's looking good. We'll probably have to do some work with our cattle, I think, this afternoon. But things are looking pretty good here. We're at a late winter, hopefully, next couple days here. We'll get the melt will start happening again. And we'll get into spring. Get back to work. All right, things are looking good, guys. Let's get to work today, all right? Let's do this, bitter patter. Clutch simulations. All right, so let's get heading into town. Look at all the snow we got down here, even. I've even had plowed everything around our bales just so we'd have access. But uh, we do need to take, why did I leave this door open? This shouldn't be open. That looks better. Um, we need to get a tractor down with us as well, so, well, I've got this hooked up. We're ready to rock here with Kenworth. We'll hop on in. And uh, we'll park up front. And then we'll go grab the... I believe we'll grab the 70... Uh, what are we, The 7810. What is going on? Am I stuck on something already? Oh, I am too. I didn't think I was that close to the pole. Crash counter one! <laughs> um, this trailer is a bit of a pig to move around sometimes. There we go. Alright. There we go. We're out of the snowbank at least. Now... We'll head into town. We've got those two dealerships we need to plow out. Give them a hand in town a little bit. Things are... Uh, it's not a lot of snow, but it's just enough that it makes things kind of miserable to try and drive around. Perfect. Alright, let's get out in front. We'll go grab the 7810. And we need to grab the snowblower as well. Get that all hooked up. Alright, we've got our snowblower. We've got the 7810. Let's go get loaded up and take this down into town. Do a little bit of work for the day. Give people a hand in town. Now, I had a couple different options, of course, with the track. Well, not really. I only had the 50, uh, the 5 series. What is that? 5085? That one's a bit small. That does not like the snowblower. I've tried it several times, and it's just, it just does not have the power for it. So, we kind of were stuck with what tracker we're going to have to use on this. And the 7810 is really the only one that has that front PTO that um, is going to get the job done for me. So, it is what it is. Let's bounce this bad boy on up. Boom. Boom. Nice. Like it. Alright, who we looking there? I think that should work just fine. Oh man, look at that. Snow's all over it. That looks great. Cool. Alright, let's jump in the uh, Kenworth. Back it on up. This is such a bizarre trailer. I've never seen one that connects like this, but it only does make sense. Oh, I've got some snow still in the middle of my driveway here that's kind of in my way. Awesome. Alright. That's all hooked up, ready to go. Um, I should have fired this international up before uh, we were doing all this, so it'd be warmed up at least. But oh well, it's all right. It's been in the shop. Let me pull this out quickly here, and uh, yeah, we should be good there. Get him set up. Oh no, 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 no! Don't follow that one. We don't want that. We want you to follow this guy over here. Can you do that? Oh no, of course not. That's all right. We'll set that up in a sec. Close our doors all up. We want the cold air getting in. So we've got the John Deere and we've got our uh, our dump truck. And that's really all we should need, I think, to clear off these parking lots. Well, we'll see where we're going to put the snow. I haven't really decided yet. We'll take a look in a sec, but let's get going. We'll start heading to town. All right, looking good, looking good. Look at all the snow we had here. So I've run down here. I've been plowing this road every once in a while just throw it winter. Now, you guys may have noticed we've switched up. We're up to six-day seasons now as well. Just to bump things up a little bit, give us a little more time in the summer to uh, to get through things. I guess more like the fall in autumn, just in case, well, a rainfall comes and wrecks everything for us like it almost did this year. But uh, we should be good now with six day. We've gone up from three day to six day, and uh, we'll probably stay at six day for the time being at least. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Planning on upgrading our farm quite a bit in the next little bit, so yeah, having six day seasons will definitely make things a little easier in that sense, I suppose. We'll see how it turns out. What are we looking here? Still right behind us. Perfect. Alright. And then we just take our left here. 
Make sure no one's coming. Oh, we gotta watch for traffic. You gotta watch for traffic out on County Line. They are crazy down on this road. They do not slow down for nothing. Alright, looks like we're good to go. Perfect. Now the fuel station and uh, the Case dealership are both just when we get into town here, up on our right. So we'll cruise on into town and get set on up. Alright, just finished talking to the guys at the fuel station here. Um, <laughs> this is ridiculous. Come on guys, can't you shovel this out yourself? I guess not. Oh, well, I'll get paid for it. I moved some snow already out of the way, but uh, we'll finish this one off. This is actually quite a bit of snow. It's a, it's deceiving how big this little parking lot is right here. It's going to get a bit of snow for us for sure. And over on the far side here, this is the case parking lot over here. This isn't nearly as bad. It's just because there's, we just have to get some access into here for them so they can get in and out, get tractors in and out, um, move some equipment around. That's all. Just to, to be able to get customers basically to get in and out for parts right now. So... That's all we're doing there. This one here, well, this is going to be a bit more of a pain. Let me move this out of the way. We'll get our tractor off this at least, offloaded. Just park this. Uh, you know what? We're going to park up on this side street right here. Just to get it out of the way for the time being. And we can shut that down. Perfect. Let's go get that John Deere. We'll fire this thing up. Get it so at least it's warm. We're not going to use it right yet. I'm going to plow some snow, see if we can get some mounds built up, and then from there we may have to unload into uh, into the dump truck at some point. We'll see. We'll see how the plowing goes. But oh man, <laughs> it's a little bit of snow for sure. We'll leave this right here for now. Make sure our beacons are on so no one drives into us. You know what? We should probably put some lights on too. There we go. No one can ever see at winter time. It seems like right. All right. Perfect. I love the beacons on this truck. Look at that. Looks so good. Cool. Alright guys, let's uh, get to plowing here. Now I'm going to start off, I'm going to push off all this snow that's kind of straight in front here. Just out of the way. You know what, let's push it off to the right. That'll be, that'll be make life a little bit easier for me I think. So we'll slide this over this way. And we'll back right on up. Oh, crash counter 2 and 3. You guys didn't see that, did you? Okay, let's start right here. I'm gonna start and push. I want to push everything that's kind of on this side. Let's see if we can kind of wrap it around. We'll see how this works. I don't know yet. Oh man, come on! I, you know what? I'm gonna pack it right in here for now, and then we'll grab the snowblower afterwards. And that's what that's what we'll do. That'll work good. I like that. You gotta go really slow with this particular plow, I find. This one here is a bit more finicky. I should have grabbed the other one. I have another plow that works a little bit better, I find, than this Hauer. But this one looks better. Alright, I have to get by this car. You know what? You can move your cars out of the way, guys. That would be fantastic next time. Perfect, I'll leave that right there. Oh, man, look at the snow mounds already. Oh, yeah, get that laid up. We're definitely going to need to get that dump truck in here to, to move this snow out of the way. Like, look at the mounds I've got up in front here already. Oh, man. I was hoping to just kind of push it all up against the berm here. But I don't think that is going to work for me. Ugh, just losing traction here. Let's try this again. Push it over here, drop that blade back down. Just give it a shove. Nice. Alright, I'm gonna keep on working on this. Well, we've got a little bit more to do on this side, then we'll push on over to the far side there. Wow, this thing goes so fast to reverse. Did you guys see that's like doing like 20 in reverse. Alright, there we go. A little bit of speed. You know what? I don't want to do speed. I always forget about this plow blade does not like speed. You gotta go slow with this one. That uh, traffic truck, or the highway truck we got, it likes to go fast. This one here, you do not want to go fast on at all. That's a problem. Cool. Alright, we're getting there. We keep on working away in here. Oh, I'll grab this stuff here as well. Alright, so, well, we got the first half plowed. Um, let's just get rid of this little bank I've built here. I think this will be better suited for our uh, milling machine. What am I looking for? What? Yeah, anyways, it's a milling machine. Let's open this up. There we go. Fire that up. Let's go. Hopefully it can get connected far enough. We'll see. 
how accurate this is. Ah, there we go. Already sees it. Let's fire it up. Let's drop this down. And we should be good to go. I'm hoping. Maybe. Maybe not. Come on. Do you want to? There it goes. Just gonna have to take a sec to find it in here. Yeah, that's quite a bit of snow, but at least we've got the entrance kind of opened up in here now. That was, um, well, one of the, the problem spots, of course, because the entrance was still covered in snow. Awesome. Yeah, that works out perfect. Get all the way down here. How far can we go? I'll spin it around here. There's little spots that are a little bit tricky to get with some equipment. I'm not worried about that snowbank. That snowbank can stay there. Can I get this little piece down here for some reason? I don't know why I can't grab that. Maybe I can grab it with the plow later on. Oh, there we go. Now it's grabbing it. You just gotta be in the right spot, I suppose, for the milling machine to see it. Perfect. All right, let's go down the line here. We'll get this. Uh, is it is it still a headland? <laughs> this snow windrow, basically, of snow we got going on here. Let's see if we can grab some of this. Move this down the road. Perfect. See how far we can get, and then we're gonna have to go and jump in the truck and move it forward a bit. I think that's about as far as we're gonna get right there, guys. Let's go jump this truck. We'll move this up a little bit. There's a bit of like a flower bed right here, but that's okay. We'll get rid of the snow on top of it as well, just because we're here. And we're kind of encroaching on the road as well, of course. Not bad. All right. I got a little bit of a spot behind me. I'll just get the, the plow out once we get this done, and uh, we'll grab that little tiny spot behind me there. But you know what? Not bad at all. We'll have to dump this out in a sec. We're looking pretty good so far. And then as for dumping this, I think, you know what, right in the side there. I want to go on the far side, though. We're going to dump it over by the, where the truck's parked right now. That seems like the most logical spot to put this. Um, oh, that's going to be tight. Come on. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. There we go. Nice. Go, go, go. Um, oh, is this blade down? No, it's got to be up. No, it's got to go straight and then up, and then you'll miss. If you have it tilted, it'll still grab at the corners, and that's kind of annoying. Let's see if we can just put it up against this fence here, just to keep it out of the way. Um, oh, it's over here I have access to. Is that what it is? I gotta have access here somewhere. No. <laughs> Alright, so it wouldn't let me dump on the far side, so they don't have access to that land. So, we gotta dump from this side. Let's see how far back we can get this thing in there. Let's see. Come on, dumpy dump. We better start dumping. Why are you not dumping? There it goes. I was going to say, you better start dumping out of the back here. Oh, it's not letting me. I don't have access over there. Oh, and I'm filling up as we're dumping. <laughs> That's one way of doing it. I should probably just go and see if I can get it like, in the back corner here. Oh, man. Oh, man. Come on. Oh, so much the snow. Crash counter two. Or three, maybe four? I don't know anymore. Hey, I'm rhyming. Uh, look at the snow. Okay, we're full. That's all we got. Oh, what a mess that is. Let's see if we can just get this last little bit here and then dump it right out again. What a mess that is. That's not easy to dump there. It's not a great spot. Just inch this thing forward. Look at that. Works like a charm. This milling machine, guys, it is indispensable. I cannot work without this on any of my farms. I use this thing for everything. All right, there we go. Uh, why are you not grabbing? What are you doing? What am I hitting on here? Hitting something. Doesn't want to grab this last little bit of snow here. There we go. I was going to say, you better grab this stuff. Come on. Sometimes you just gotta kinda work it and find that right little spot to grab it, and then it'll start eating it away. So we'll continue grabbing this. I'm gonna go plow the far side. So this side's a lot simpler. I can just kind of drive back and forth and just kind of push it up against there. Put a nice little uh, windrow up on the far side. Shouldn't be too big. It's about the size of it right here, you can see. Nothing crazy, but, oh man, but I do miss a little bit for some reason here and there. I think that's just this plow. That's just the way she works. 
But other than that, this is not too bad on this side. We'll go take a look over at the case dealership here in a sec and see how that's looking. I'm not sure if that's going to be as simple. We're definitely going to have to move some snow around in there to get it out of there. I don't think they've got much room um, for putting snow anywhere. And that's kind of going to give me a bit of grief. <laughs> look at that. I'm banging that a little bit there in a sec. But the parking lot is almost plowed. That last part over there, man, it's actually a lot more snow than I was kind of anticipating. Um, it's funny how fast it builds up when you do something like this. It doesn't seem like there's a lot on the ground, but as soon as you start plowing, pushing stuff around, it piles up so unbelievably fast. Make sure I don't back into these fuel tanks. That would not be... <laughs> it would be good. <laughs> uh, push that there. Perfect. All right, let me finish this off. We'll grab... Uh, I think we're not going to need to grab any more snow off of this other than this. I'm not going to need to fill any, anything up in the back. We'll go take a look at that case dealership and see what we got over there. Looks like we got some more work still to do. Perfect. Parking lot looks pretty good, guys. Oh, let's start that back up. Um, I'm happy with that. That looks good. We've got some banks on the far side. Got some over here. All we got left to do, guys, is the uh, the case dealership. Now, let's take a quick look here. I went in and talked to them. Let's see what they want exactly. Oh, now they need a path that comes through the main area right through here. Now, they're obviously not going to need to be really getting access to this equipment, so I can put some windrows on both sides if I need to. The problem is going to be over on this side. This side here is kind of their parking area, and uh, they don't want to move the tractor. I don't know. They could move the tractor for me, couldn't they? Ah, oh, man. So we need to get over here as well, see if we can make a little bit of room, at least out in front of the case here, and then down this side. I don't know how much I'm going to be able to do down here with what we got, but we'll do what we can. All right, so far, so good. Let's just wrap this up quickly. We got other things I want to do today. Um, not much left to do, just this parking lot area. I'm just going to push the snow back up against the back of these grain bins. I think that'll be the best bet, and then they'll at least have access to their parking lot. Should be okay to do it that way. We just kind of get in right here. These cars are kind of parked in the middle of nowhere is my problem. Let's see if we can push this up, and then kind of just push it towards those grain bins. And we'll probably sneak one pass all the way through here. That's... Oh, 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 watch out for the case. Come on. Come on. Oh, man. We can just jam a bunch of snow right in the middle of them there. Look at that. <laughs> uh, let's see if we can get one pass so they can get equipment through the, the side here without going all the way out. Well, that'll be kind of key, I'm sure. Just go, like, right to here. I'll just push this all the way through. It's a bit of a mess, but not bad. They at least have access to this. They can get access to their back shop. I'll let them worry about their own front shop. I mean, if they wanted me to get in here, they could move some equipment around at least, right? And they got tractors. They should have been able to do something. <laughs> um, all right, not too bad. Just a little bit of work left to do here, and uh, we'll get rid of all this stuff that's kind of left over. But I don't think I'll need to uh, really go too too crazy on oh man this is getting rough in here holy look at this let's lift the blade up a little bit here that might help me a little bit let's see if i can push just some of the snow up in the middle here but we all have to get this all the way to the other side as well go nice and easy just putt oh, nice and easy and this should just come off and push to the side perfect so i'll just finish off plowing this all up and uh yeah we'll be done with helping out for the day head back to the farm check on our cows all right, let's load them up, head them on out. We are done. Not bad. Uh, you at least have access around everything in here. Ooh, I've got a bit of a mess to clean up here. Can I just pick this up and do this quickly here? This is always a fight. Let's see if I can just get this blade nice and straight. Push this up here. Perfect. You know what? That's not bad. That'll work. We'll do it once more. Um, yeah, things are looking good. I'm happy. We got everything plowed that we needed to. They've got access to everything they need to have access to now. We can head back, be happy with the job we got done here. Let's go take a look at our cows, see what we're going on. We gotta grab the John Deere, load this thing up. Actually, you know what? Let's leave that there for now. I'll grab the John Deere, load it up, and head back to the farm. So, just of course, as always, our cows are out of food. They're always out of something, it seems like. I've always gotta be down here. Let's wrap this up. I don't need this in here to back in. Um, we'll give them a little more TMR. Now, I'm really happy with this barn. What I can't figure out what I want to do is with the other one. 
I'm still on the fence on that limousine barn. Uh, or not the barn, sorry, the limousine area. The outdoor cattle pasture I have, I'm not a huge fan of this one. Um, come on, nice. This one here is... Uh, guys, I don't know what to do with this yet. I want to change this up. I'm not really happy with the way it looks. I'm not really happy with the amount of cows we can put in it. Because I think we're maxed out at 50, 60, something like that. Maybe it's 100. I can't remember anymore. But we're maxed out with it. It's not great. It's just not great. I feel like it's too small. Um, so this is something we want to fix at some point in the near future. And we may do it, well, as soon as the spring hits. On top of that, our horse area. Right here, I have kind of... Well, I've gotten rid of the horses for the time being. Um, it was becoming a bit of a pain for some straw. They weren't doing so well this winter, so we decided to get rid of the horses that time. Now, I don't know if I'm going to keep this. I don't think so. I think I may push this into a bigger cattle area, this whole field here. We have an option to maybe make this into a larger cattle pasture. Get rid of this barn, get rid of the horses here, and just focus on cows. These, the horses aren't, they're okay, but we're not getting a ton of money out of it. Um, what we're getting a lot of money out of is milk cattle. Milking those cows is making us a ton of cash. And the horses, I don't know. We've got the horse ranch. I'm even thinking about selling the horse ranch just because I don't want to deal with it anymore. I kind of want to focus more on, well, cows and all this that's going on here. So let me know what you guys think in the comments of that. Uh, if there's something maybe I should do instead, uh, I'd love to hear about it there. But that's going to do it for us today. Hope you guys enjoyed our little plowing session. Having a little bit of fun in the winter here on the county line. Hopefully by tomorrow, spring will be here and we'll be back into the fields. Man, county line, it's what, season four now? Yeah, something like that. It's going by fast. Once so again, guys, hope you enjoyed. Drop a like if you did. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I will see you guys next time. This is Glutch. Over and out. Thank you.